Hi guys, welcome back. I've just come on here really quickly to do a super quick video sharing our favourite books for geography. I get a lot of questions about geography and how we do our lessons and generally for us a lot of focus is on books. So I'm going to give you a flip through of three of our favourites. The maps book is easily our favourite book for geography and you'll see why as soon as I open it. It's the only map book that I've ever found for kids that is so um, cartoonified and engaging and there's just so much to look at and so much to see. So it has a lot, most of the countries and there are, in the corner here you'll see the name of the country, the flag, the capital city, the language is spoken, the population and the area of that country as well. And then there is so much to look at as far as food, people, famous people that come from that country, famous myths or legends and certain animals that come from that country. There's just so much to see. And at the back here we have the flags of the countries that are featured in this book. And then we have the continents with all the countries all the way through. It's such a fun book to just get out and explore. And to be honest with you, my kids even get this out and just look through it on their own all the time. The second book is the Maps of the United Kingdom. I will link these in the description for you. So this is very similar to the Maps book but it focuses on the countries of the United Kingdom. So we have England, and we have the map of England here. And then it takes you through all the places in England. Famous people, famous foods, famous um, heritage sites, and landmarks, you name it. And then we have the same thing for Wales, Scotland and Northern Ireland. So that's another great one if you live in the UK like we do. Lastly, I am a big fan of the DK encyclopedias. Let's take a look at why I use this for geography. <laughs> contents as you can see there's a lot we've got planet earth rocks and minerals water climate and weather life on earth and the human world mapping the world and country fact file so this as with all dorian kingsley books the images are perfectly clear really engaging beautiful images and that's one of the reasons i love their encyclopedias and use them a lot and we have a lot of topics covered in here so when we did our Collins primary geography we pulled this out a lot for volcanoes and moon phases and planet earth as I've mentioned we did use the Collins primary geography um, and we are using it at the moment we're about to go into book three and so we do have their first atlas this is just another really great map book for young learners. So those are our favourite books for geography. If you have any questions please leave me a comment. All the books will be listed in the description and if you have any other subject book recommendations that you want just let me know in a comment.